Nitian and guys, welcome you back to yet another episode. I welcome you all with my love and respects and the blessings of my Guru, His Divine Holiness, Bhagwan Shri Nityan the Paramashivam. In today's episode, a powerful cognition about why the Guru disciple relationship. The Guru is basically, I think I shared it, this example in a previous video where he is the stick that you use to burn all the other sticks. And at the end, you also discard that stick. Discarding in the way that uh, the Guru will never allow you. If the Guru is really enlightened, if he, he, if he has established the space of the ultimate, and if he is taking full responsibility, uh, which he is supposed to if he takes the role of Guru, of the disciple, then um, he has to make sure that you free yourselves from all the patterns that you cherish, all the forms of attachment that you uh, use as a way to remain in your comfort zone and which is responsible for you not to radiate super consciousness or your ultimate possibility or uh, that space of Paramashiva Tua. So the Guru is there to empower you constantly in your journey towards the ultimate and as you do that, he is also there to remove in a way that is um, easy to digest all the forms of incompletions, pain patterns, attachments and sufferings that we generate for ourselves without understanding or unconsciously and that we are bound by and bind, uh, bound with. So he is responsible to remove that from us and like that, he guides us towards that ultimate space in which he is established for us to realize oneness with him. So, um, so yeah, Guru is very important for that. He, even Swamiji shared in a satsang, actually that's very powerful, uh, something to seek about, but he said that if you have the right context for why do you have Guru in your life, he said, even if your Guru is not enlightened, you can get enlightened. So it is really about the depth of your seeking, the strength of your context, and the depth and the intensity of your decision to be integrated to your Guru, which allows the surrender to happen and which allows Paramashiva to uh, reveal itself and radiate through uh, you. So yes, so that is also uh, another very simple powerful cognition that uh, that we should constantly contemplate on. So in, in the, we feel sometimes that Guru is an attachment, but actually it is not. It is an attachment which has the only purpose of removing all attachments from you. And at some point it also means that attachment itself. And that only when the time comes, the disciple is ready, then the Guru can operate and allow this surgery to happen in the disciple for the disciple to realize the ultimate. So that is another reason why Guru-Disciple relationship. So stay tuned. I'll see you guys in the next episode tomorrow. Subscribe, like, comment. And uh, yes, keep the seeking for the Guru-Disciple relationship alive in your life and experience more and more life in your life. Nidhyanandam.